The team of Cor de Hague can be referred to as the Clamper dynasty. He won a first national propignan with a youngster of stock breeder Clamper already in 1997. The descendants of this exceptional breeder continue to win national first prizes, in Cor's own loft and in the lofts of fanciers from Belgium and abroad. There is not a lot that has not been said about Cor de Hague, who achieved some truly exceptional results in the marathon competition in the last decade. He has won numerous national first prizes, and an impressive number of other fanciers have been very successful with coarse pigeons both at home and abroad. It would be almost impossible to include them all. The pigeon that is mainly responsible for this success story is Coors breeding bird Clamper, an exceptional pigeon that bred hundreds of descendants that were able to win a top result in the National Classic. Cor could no longer keep up with the impressive number of references. The results in the Barcelona Classic are particularly eye-catching. It appears Cor's pigeons have really excelled in this race season after season. For instance, the 2015 edition saw no less than 10 de Hade pigeons finish in the national top 60 in Belgium and the Netherlands. As we said, Clamper is the undisputed number one stock breeder of this loft. He was obtained during his comeback in the 1990s as an old bird with ring number, NL8418701049. 25 years later this breeding cock continues to demonstrate his value every season. It would be impossible to include every top result from Clamper's many descendants but we will be discussing some of the most successful ones, just to give you an idea of his breeding value. Cord de Haight is general director and project developer of his construction company Lage Zwilu, and therefore a very busy man. Cor became interested in pigeon racing through his father. At that time there were only 120 fanciers in the small community of Maid. In the 60s. He got to know Pi de Weird. This threw his son Hank de Weird who had just completed his studies to become a veterinary surgeon. Cor became friends with Pite and went along with him to the many top lofts, where Pite was asked to select the pigeons, and Cor got to handle numerous top pigeons. Pite was internationally recognized as an inspecting master and had an enormous feeling for muscles. Cor as he himself says has really learned a lot from him. It was also Pied de Weird who imparted the finesses to Cor with regard to inspecting the muscles and assessing the vitality. To this day, Cor still uses the selection method, which he learned from Pied de Weird. In 1972, one can state that the loft has mainly been built with the Gen Arden strain. This is the type of pigeon that Cor likes the most and which he has always been in search of. When Corner buys new pigeons, it doesn't matter if they are old or young birds because he has patience with pigeons if he sees something in them. He has bought a lot of pigeons from Pipe Laser Rooms from Zeg, an ardent collector of the Gen Arden derivation. Also through Pipe and Hank de Weird and Jan Herman's pigeons of this lineage were introduced to his loft. By means of John Lambricht's is there, since 1972 Catrice blood to be found in the pedigrees. Young pigeons were bought from Jack Turnier in Lamal, Jan Thielen in Bugenum, and Shreetin Vissers in Beek. Due to a few carefully chose purchase from national top fanciers such as a son from Het Wonder Van Neer, and through breeding with other fanciers, Cor has built up his pedigree. One pigeon in particular has played a leading part the Out Lambrix 73, BE 672-2512, which Cor bought from John Lambrix in Belgium, the author of the famous pigeon books. This was the most complete and best pigeon that Cor has ever had in his lofts. He even achieved five first prizes, including two from Orleans and each time with an amazing lead. Later it turned out that he was a good breeder and descendants from him not only won first prizes from hundred, but also thousand kilometer races. His blood is still to be found in many of Cor's pigeon. The Clamper Dynasty In 1991 Cor decided to focus on the overnight long distance. Only his very best pigeons would be joining the team, and he also wanted to strengthen his existing breeding loft by introducing some national champions. He obtained eight old birds of pied laserms from Zeg, which Cor got to pick himself. Among them were NL8418701049, Clamper, and a half-sister, NL81308, which was one of the strongest long-distance pigeons in Netherlands at the time. 
Clapper never competed in any races because he had once been attacked by a bird of prey. Cor obtained three youngsters of Pied de Weirds out Croc, the sire of a 6th and 8th National Barcelona in 1987, as well as one of his granddaughters. He also purchased a daughter of Spinach Barcelona and an inbred daughter of Desmerigd from Jan Hermans. Both their parents had won a National Barcelona. These pigeons, along with his existing collection, allowed Cor to make a fresh start. Clamper showed his impressive breeding value already in 1993, when he was paired to a granddaughter of Oud Croc. Together they bred Racing Bird NL 93-934-55-59, winner of a 1st, 7th and 15th per Pignan, and a 21st National Barcelona, which resulted in the title of 4th International Ace Pigeon in 1995. Clamper was paired to Mui Donker of Pike Lazerums that season, and together they bred quite some prize winners as well, including Perpignandoffer. Perpignandoffer won a 7th National Perpignan against 5,042 pigeons as a 1-year-old, as well as a 59th National Perpignan against 4,342 pigeons, and a 242nd National POW against 2,156 pigeons as a 2-year-old. He proved to be an invaluable breeder as well. He is the sire and grandfather of many national and international prize winners both at home and abroad. Naomi is a granddaughter of Propignandoffer and she won a sixth national of 5,423 pigeons in the 2014 race from Barcelona. She finished in 21st place national of 2,181 hens. Marianne is a great-grandchild of Propignandoffer and winner of a first national St. Vincent, Sector 1, of 9,672 pigeons in 2014. Marianne is another exponent of the renowned Clamper bloodline, which both her parents are closely related to. Don Michel is now the sire of Miss Marseille and L99 982-9107, third national Marseille against 5,884 pigeons and Zondon Don Michel, NL5 217785, 16th National Propignan against 5,409 pigeons, and 13th Inchinal Ace Pigeon Barcelona Propignan. Don Michel was paired to a granddaughter of Clamper in 2008, and together they bred Jong Don Michel NL8 381-85-93. This Jong Don Michel has a 94th. 100th and 355th National Barcelona on his Palmers, as well as a 17th and a 74th National Propignan. It resulted in the title of 13th International Ace Pigeon in the PIPA ranking Barcelona Propignan, 2011, and 51st International Ace Pigeon Barcelona ZLU 2013. His very own descendants appear to be quite talented as well, judging by the results of his daughter, Blue Dream. The last pigeon that deserves a mention is Klein Blaw, NL13 a young but promising pigeon and yet another successful descendant of the Clamper bloodline. She won a 105th burger rack of 3,854 pigeons as a yearling, before claiming a national first prize from St. Vincent of 15,918 pigeons as a two-year-old in 2015. The youngsters, grandchildren and great-grandchildren of Clamper have been crushing the national marathon races in the past 20 years. Cor won a first national propignan with a direct son NL 93 934 55 59 already in 1997, and 20 years later the Clamper descendants are still competing for the top prizes in the national races. You have probably figured out by now that Clamper has been an invaluable pigeon for Cor who has won numerous first prizes and top results at national level thanks to this pigeon. Many other fanciers have been very successful with Clamper's descendants as well. The list of achievements continues to grow over the years, and Cor himself continues to perform at a very high level as well. Cor's list of references and his achievements at home does not really reflect the enormous breeding value of Clamper and his descendants. Year in, year out. Cor de Hade shines on the national and international extreme long-distance races. His sensational result on Barcelona 2021 underlines his status as world-class fancier. Thank you for watching. Until next time.